this or not, you think? I don't know. I didn't get notified again. I did it. I did it. Oh, I did. Oh, there we are. We're live. We can see it right here. Good morning. I think a bird just hit the window. Did you hear so. that? <laughs> And the bird just flew right in the window. Uh, good morning, everyone. It is Sunday or Saturday morning. We are uh, live and at it. We are in the midst of the sale, and uh, you guys are taking advantage of that uh, a lot. So um, we've got lots of stuff to talk about. I've got a little demo thing going on, side covers of the day. And uh, another thing on the bases, but did you want to start? Or no, you, go ahead. Oh, I guess I'm going to start. Let me wake up. Oh, the microphone. Wait. No mic. Oh, man. Yeah, we just, uh, it's been crazy busy around here this morning. So if, this, if the sign or the sound isn't working right, um, sorry. I don't want to see any comments on here yet. No, they're there. I don't know. Hopefully, the, we got sound now. Okay. All right. So. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there it is. Okay. Sorry, guys. <laughs> it's been crazy this morning. Oh, my gosh. We've been going for a while. Um, anyway, so I'll talk first. You want to uh, do that after I do my little uh, announcement thing? Yeah. Okay, so first things first. If you guys missed it, you guys know our our uh, bases. This has got the paper on it, but this is uh, clear. And um, our base plates, that, that is. Not bases, but base plates. We have modified these slightly, and we've started shipping them out, uh, I don't know, a couple weeks ago maybe. But they now look like this they look kind of frosted on the front side now when i when dad first uh, proposed doing this i thought no that's not going to work because then i can't see through the through the plate uh you know what let me pull this back just slightly so you guys can see what i'm talking about So maybe that will show, maybe it won't. But it, it looks kind of frosted because the top side is sanded. And um, so when, I, when Dad first brought this to me and asked me about it, I thought, no, that won't work because I can't see through the, through the base as well as I could when it was crystal clear. But then I carved a couple signs with it, and I realized I never took my eye off of the router bit. I, it didn't really matter that this was kind of opaque over here. It really made no difference at all. I looked, huh? I looked at just where the router bit was. So, uh, just an FYI, guy, guys, when you order a base plate over the next few weeks, they may come, um, they may come clear like this one, or the new version may come uh, sanded on the top frosted, side. Yeah. yeah, like it looks frosted. And it really makes no difference at all. And it really helps out dad in the manufacture of it, um, making all these letters uh, black. So anyway, that's that deal. So we will keep selling, uh, shipping these out until the supply is exhausted. And then everything within, probably within a few weeks, will come this way. So just wanted to give you guys another heads up. We talked about it a couple weeks ago, but I haven't talked about it in the last week or two so somebody emailed me on it this morning and uh so i wanted to go over that again are you ready yet no, no not yet okay so i uh i'm gonna go on with mine now i got a question and this one was really a good question and this is something that i should have covered before 
But I did, I went out and based on this question, I went out and, and worked for a few minutes, made some sawdust, and I want to show you guys what I did. So the question is from Dwayne Throckmorton. My question is more of a curiosity day than anything else. When you do your background cleanup, do you always go deeper than what you carve? I've ex been uh, experimenting, and sometimes if I set the 90 degree bit to the same depth as my profile bit, I don't seem to get the same good looking background. Is it just me, or do you run into this as well? So here's what I did. I did uh, a sample, kind of an experiment, and I've got three different depths of, um, of background. I'm hoping that shows up. I can get closer to the camera. So this is one-eighth deep. This is three-sixteenths deep, and this is one-quarter inch deep. Yeah, I, I need to get closer? Yeah, okay. So you guys might want to, you know, when when this replays, maybe zoom in on it. But this is eighth, three sixteenths, and a quarter, and um, it works. I, I I would go. I'm always somewhere in this area, three sixteenths to a quarter, um, almost always. I over here, eighth inch to three sixteenths. That's just way too shallow. Now let me show you what it what they look like when they're sprayed and sanded off. That's eighth inch, three sixteenths, and a quarter. The biggest issue is obviously high spots. Now you can take uh, you can take and touch those up, which you know you guys all know how to do, either with a Sharpie or you know with a uh, a brush or whatever, you can always touch those up. Uh, even three sixteenths you end up with some high spots a little bit. And I didn't try to get those high spots. That's just what happens when you sand off the surface and you take a little bit of wood off. That's just what happens. But you can see this looks much, much better. So um, I, I answered Dwayne and I said, you want to be around a quarter of an inch. Now this won't have any um, effect on how deep uh, if you've got the room, let me say that. So even if I carve my letters at an eighth inch, between an eighth and three sixteenths, um, I still want to go close to a quarter of an inch on the background because it just looks better and you've got less chance for high spots. Uh, so, and this is, oh, by the way, before I forget, this is with a 90 degree bit. Now, that being said, this is just my process. If you guys like flat bottom, uh, if you like a different background, knock yourself out. I'm just telling you what I do. This is my process. So you definitely want to be more toward the quarter of an inch than eighth of an inch. <laughs> what? Pam Barry said, Vicki, you look tired. <laughs> I am. It's because you just woke up. I did not. No. She is. Uh, she, you stay up late. Though. I stay up late, but I just so what, got I'll, so much going on in my head. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, we got some issues going on yeah but we're taking care of them yeah you do look tired do i uh, yeah. you know what too i think it's so hot out here and it's so dry and i think my allergies because i've been sneezing like crazy i think my allergies are acting up and i slept wrong on my neck so i got a kink in my neck <laughs> getting old sucks <laughs> all right um, uh, i'm gonna let you take okay. it and then i'll do sign covers of the day at the end okay uh, I oh. think I'll go back there when you do sign carvers so okay. that I can zoom in. Good morning, Dan. Good morning, everybody. All right. <laughs> I hate when he does that. I know. That's why That's why I like to do it. All right. All right, guys. So I'm getting a lot of questions. I've, I probably had 19 emails. I know I had 19 emails this morning. Half of those were people that... Um, I think misunderstood the sale um, and what we had talked about um, I don't know a week or so ago about when you order a layout template set a normal layout template set 10 templates for $25 you can pick 10 individual templates to um, create your own set um, and when you do that, it, one, you either have to call me because you can't do it on the website with the prices changed. 
uh, where the prices will be different um, or order any set and in the comments list the items the templates that you want so um, I know Pam this morning uh, Pam ordered templates and then just ordered all of them and actually there were three of them like this ordered the templates that you wanted but you ordered the templates and then a set and so it was confusing and then um, <laughs> it's really confusing so if you want to make your own set order any set on the website in the comments please list the 10 templates that you want and they are the templates the normal size templates that are 350 not the five dollar templates not the ten dollar templates so just the three dollar and fifty cent templates um good point are the ones that you can put in a set because the other ones don't come in a set they're individual five dollars and some are 750 that's or the whatever. big deer scene the big ones and yeah deer and all those um yeah. and then as far as the uh the 26, I keep saying 16, 2017, what's this one, 2019, 2017, and 2018 sets. These we do not split up. These we do not customize. These are strictly what they are. They're the templates of the month for the year 2017, all the templates of the month for 18 and 19. Those, these 12 cannot be split up. I keep doing that and I apologize. They can't be split up and they can't be customized. You can't order what... The templates you know 12 templates and put them in this set this set is strictly those sets no altering no changing no uh, substitutions I guess um, so the 2017 templates and I know you guys can't see these these real well they are on the website 17 2018 covering my face which I tell you not to do all the time mm -hmm. and 2019 so those are those sets. Cannot be broke up, cannot be customized, cannot be substituted. So I hope that's clear, you guys. Um, I did refund Pam and I refunded somebody else. So though you did get your refund and Pam, you didn't take your discount. If you guys have issues with putting your um, discount code in, please call me so that I can walk you through that process. Um, that way you get your discount before you even pay for anything. So. Any questions? Uh, yeah, for me, nothing for you. Oh. Well, I don't know. There might be <laughs> down, but I wanted to make sure that I answered. Oh, okay. uh, so uh, Matt says it gave me more control with more hands on the wood. Absolutely, Matt, it, it, and everybody. The more you can keep your contact with the wood with your hands when you're carving, uh, the better off you're going to be. So a lot of people they get a death grip on that on that base plate and uh, they don't think about keeping contact. You're just guiding that router. You don't have to have a death grip on it. So anyway, um, that's just a comment. Uh, Charles, uh, so Charlie, one real quick question that I have is when you carve something like I did the bear, do you find if you do the background that you lose detail? Um, Charlie, I don't know specifically, I apologize. I know I've seen the bear that you carved, but I don't know specifically what you're referring to. I do not find that I lose detail by doing the background. So again, if you're doing outset letters or if you're doing a bear that's outset, make sure make sure that, that if you're not carving it deep enough that you go around it again deeper with a profile bit. Um, and you can go around a deeper one pass around with the the 90 degree bit as well, um, but I don't I don't really find that by doing the background that I lose detail, I, I, and and I may me be misjudging what you're asking. But if you want to give me more details on that with pictures, uh, shoot me an email and I'll uh, I'll let you, give you my thoughts on it. Okay. Um, first of all, Pam and uh, who else was it? Pam and John. It's okay. Do not apologize. It's not a problem. I fixed it. I refunded you guys. Don't don't worry about it. It happens all the time. I'm just kind of giving you guys an FYI. Um, Matt uh, Matt wants to know if a uh, mana makes a wider bit than a ninety. A mana bit. makes about. 12 million different <laughs> router bits. 
So if you have some dimensions on what you want, Matt, I have a catalog and I'm a dealer. They give me like screaming deals. I just had uh, shipped something to a guy in Atlanta and they shipped it, they drop shipped it directly from uh, Mana right to him. It was a really uh, complicated big bit. So you can go, if you go on a MANA website, you can look at their catalog, or if you wanna just shoot me the dimensions of what you're thinking of, then um, I'll, I'll look in the catalog and see if I can find a part number for you. Okay, so a manual S something, I'm sorry man, I'm not even gonna try to pronounce your last name. Will the baseboards go on sale? I'm assuming that you mean the router base plates, and you never know, Sometimes they might. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they might. Um, That's a product that we, we could do a sale on, and we have in the past. That's a product that we could do a sale on. We don't have anything planned as of right now. I think our next upcoming sale is going to be the Black Ooh. Friday sale in November. So. Yeah. Yeah. That one, that's like the big one. That's but, the biggest of the year. And we don't know what that's going to be yet. We haven't got past this one, so just keep an eye out. Yep. Pam, it's okay. Do not worry about it. No worries. It's all good. Um, let's see. Okay. Uh, Pam, Pam put it through her computer and is acting weird. Pam, it's okay. No worries. Larry's watching. Larry, my cousin? Skip. Skip. Hi, Skip. Hey, Skip. Larry. Skip. You will always be Skip to me. Um, okay. Uh, I guess that's it. Nobody's got yeah, any questions. Yeah, I think that's about it. Oh, uh, I'll go on to the sign carvers of the okay, day. Okay. Um, got a fantastic group of sign carvers of the day. It, it, it's incredible. Okay. Um, so mm -hmm. I'm going to go around to the other side so that I can zoom in on the sign carvers of the day because you guys like to see those and I don't want to have to pull them up to the camera. So, uh, so. I'm going around the other side. I'm okay. taking this with me. Of course you Actually, are. Actually, I don't need to because I can see my Yeah, head. you're going to see right there. Cool. All right. All right. Uh, here we go. Steve, I think it's Bally. Could be. Yeah, I think it is. So this is, uh, this is his wife. She's a country music singer. Or she's a singer. I think it's country music. Um... I just didn't know there was any other kind of music, actually. But anyway, she's a singer. This is one of Steve's first signs, which is really cool. Um, doing an arch like that and that artwork, terrific oh, job, I Steve. Can, no, I can't get any closer on it. It looks okay. pretty good on the camera. Oh, oh, I can. Okay. All right. Good job, Steve. I love it. Randy Q. Randy wow. Quaintance. Check that one out. We actually, I had, I was talking to him on the phone the other day, and uh, we were talking about this sign. Uh, amazing, amazing job, Randy. Turn that. Don't watch that. Do this. Huh? <laughs> Turn the phone. You're watching the phone <laughs> and not paying attention to what you're doing. All right, all right, all right. Guys, I haven't trained him after 39 years. You would think. Jeff, Jeff Clown, Clown, Wow. Clown. Nice. Fifth, sixth, and seventh signs. Amazing. Fantastic job, Jeff. I love all the artwork and the different colors. Terrific job, buddy. Great job. Bill Wallace. Gosh. Wow. This is his third sign. Ooh. Wow. Amazing. This is for his, uh, his daughter and son-in-law. Amazing job. Looks like it's on a piece of live edge black walnut to me. Great job. Oh, gorgeous. And Jeff. This is Jeff's first sign with our uh, with our supplies, with our, you know, layout letters and router bits and whatnot. Terrific job, Jeff. Uh, Jeff, Jeff Groff. I think it's Groff. All right. We Terrific. Have, we okay. Have, we have some questions. Oh, do we? I wouldn't know. Well, you're not supposed to read the questions while you're doing the side carvers of the day. My gosh. All right. You guys? Go. <laughs> uh, Lewis, Brian, discount code. I missed it. Send me an email, Lewis, and I will send it to you. I don't have it off the top of my head. Amanda should give, uh, Julie, uh, Jason Harrison, Amanda should give you a deal with how many bits you sell directly for them. DeWalt. 
two would be an interesting how many people have bought the DeWalt because of your recommendation. Uh, probably I, a lot. I think I've sold a lot of DeWalt routers. Reuben and Lily, I'm not going to try. Uh, you've been great helping me with my orders, and on the one time there was an issue, you took care of it quickly. Great customer service. Thank you, Reuben. Matt, uh, let's see. Eric, Matt says, watch out, you're going to get in trouble. Somebody what else did I question. do? <laughs> I didn't do anything. <laughs> you always say that, and you're so full of crap. All right, so uh, where okay, are we at? I think we're at you yelling in my ear. <laughs> And it begins. <laughs> Just a normal day. <laughs> we're all, a normal I'm day. I'm waking up. Um, uh, can't find the DeWalt Orbital Sander anywhere. They are sold out. Do wow. we have them on the website? Yeah, or they're in, we our have them in our Amazon Both store. Both the sanders, the random orbital and the disc sander. Remember, the disc sander is the handheld, uh, like a pistol grip with a handle. That's the disc sander. Good morning, Freddy. And then the, the uh, random orbital is like a palm sander. They're both in our Amazon hmm. store. I know. Somebody asked somewhere. Hold on. But maybe they're out. I don't know. Oh, Dave Rossiter said, for this sale, will you go through eBay option? Yes. If you send me an email what you want, I will definitely give you the sale price. Absolutely. For international... I think Dave's in Canada, right? Uh, I'm not sure. I can't remember. But if you are an international outside the U.S., and you want to get in on this sale, you absolutely can. Just send me an email what you want. I will set up a private listing with the sale price and everything, and we'll take care of it that way just like we do anything else. So, absolutely, Dave. Good point. Uh, we hadn't talked about that. That's really a good yeah. point. <laughs> he just sits back and laughs, Dan. He, he says, get Dave to uh, referee you guys. He just sits back and laughs at us. It's just and he stirs it up. Yeah, he, does, he does. He does stir it, and it's normally in his favor. So they gang up on me. Actually, that's not true. He more gangs he up on my He side. normally takes <laughs> he your takes side. My side. Um, uh, so see. tell us what you guys thought of this morning's uh, senior moment. If you've watched it on I YouTube, I haven't watched it yet. It, I I just had so much fun doing that, and Monday is going to be a continuation of that. And I've only got about halfway through the questions, and I'm getting more. You guys are going to see more of that. Um, I'm sorry, I, I, I'm selfish that way. I want to get my dad on camera doing that more and more. So I, I don't want it to be a detriment to doing demos and teaching, but um, dad's not going to be around forever, and I want him on camera telling those stories as much as I well, possibly can. Well, and didn't can. he remember one after the camera was he off? Did. He remembered another he did, one. That, that I'd never heard. Yeah. 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 So um, at, at, at the very least, uh, Monday, you're going to see more of that. Wednesday, I think, is going to be back <laughs> to our, our project. But then uh, Saturday, I think Saturday, next Saturday, is going to be more uh, interview with Dad. So yeah. just be ready for it. If you Everybody don't want to watch it, to like it, if you don't want to watch it, turn it off. But I'm going to do it anyway. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm selfish. Uh, Frank says, you two balance your marriage. <laughs> uh, okay. That's one way to put it. I'm not going to touch that. Uh, Matt says, we do too. So thanks for sharing those moments. There's some great stories. Yep. Okay. All right, you guys. I'm sure you guys have things to do. We, we have definitely have things to do. To do. So. Uh, and I uh, just want to say real quick. And, oh, look, Bunny. He's hopping right up to the house. <laughs> How cute. Sorry. I, <laughs> Bunny rabbit. You're just hopping. <laughs> um, uh, I want to thank you guys for supporting us all the time. I mean, every which way. It's uh, incredible. You know, just... We're dumbfounded. I got up this morning and <laughs> the number count blew me away. Um, and so it's going to be a busy day, but we love it. And um, yeah. we hope that we're giving you guys, um, you know, what you need. I don't, I don't know what to say. We're just, we're dumbfounded. So, but thank you guys so much. Absolutely. Um, Absolutely. Let's see. Okay. Um, one of these days. <laughs> We've been talking about this because I had a thought. One of these days we're going to get on here and not wait. We'll talk a little bit of business, but we're going to kind of tell our story. 
That'll be interesting. Oh, yeah, we're going to tell our story about how we met and how we got started going here. Yeah. But um, so I don't know if you guys want to hear that or not, but let me know if that, that's something you would like to know because it's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> it, it's, uh, yeah, it, it's an interesting uh, story. Oh, thanks, you guys. Thanks so much, guys. Uh, we love you. All right. That would be great. Um, you guys got things to do. All right, guys, yes. We got to get back to we work. We got to get back to work. Um, have a great weekend. Yeah. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to call. And um, <laughs> somebody said something last night. What time can I call you? As long as it's not after 10 o'clock at night or before 7 o'clock in the morning, you can call anytime. Um, yeah. Uh, Got a call the other morning, 4 a.m. 4 a.m. I was already at my computer, but it was a gentleman in Scotland. Yeah. And, uh, and he, he had no idea of the time difference, but he was in Scotland. And uh, it was fun talking to him. It was a challenge. <laughs> Real Scotland. Scottish accent. accent. Okay. It was crazy. All right. All we're right, going to wrap gotta it up. So That's you guys it. have a great weekend, and we'll see you on, uh, he'll see you on Monday's live. No yep. video tomorrow. Well, there'll be a video, there'll but a no video. live tomorrow. Yep. So enjoy your day. God bless, and we'll see you later. Soon. Bye. Yeah. Bye, I guys. Oh, I got to go over there. Love, yeah, you got to turn it off <laughs> over there. <laughs> we need a remote. Love you guys. Have a great weekend. Bye.